since this federal hill district is legendary for its rich Italian heritage and delicious eats. And in the early 1980s, the neighborhood gave birth to a one-of-a-kind culinary gem, the grilled pizza. Ever since, locals have flocked to Bob and Timmy's for grilled greatness by the slice. What is, in your opinion, the advantage of the grilled crust? I like the grilled crust a little better because uh, they do it in olive oil, put it right on the grill, you just get that grilled flavor. There's nothing that compares to it. There's a little saying that we do. What's the saying? My grandmother's very Italian, just like most of the people in Rhode Island. And when you pull the cheese, you have to say UD, which means, oh God. Really? Yes. UD. Oh, uh, give us this day our daily grilled pizza. Amen. And while all of Bob and Timmy's grilled pies are amazing, the red pepper layered chicken pizza to the fully loaded everything, I'm heading to the kitchen for a true Rhode Island classic, the spinach and mushroom pie. So this good gentleman is Jose Sanchez and you are one of the owners here. The actual grilling of pizza, that's strict Rhode Island, right? Yes. You're not likely to find a pie like we're gonna make anywhere else. The pie begins with nine ounces of homemade dough soaked in olive oil. In olive oil? Olive oil, yes. Over the small stick and the grill. What's well, also going to be kind of incredible, all that flavor from the olive oil and the charcoal heat, it's going to give the crust flavor before we even add the very first topping. After two minutes over 500 degree coals, Jose flips the dough. Oh, wow. You can actually see where the grill touched it. It looks almost like grilled pizza bread. And it's time for the topping. Unlike oven baked pizzas, the toppings for a grilled pie are added right on the grill. Jose sprinkles on fresh garlic and coats the pie with thickly shredded Parmesan cheese. Wait a minute, now that's amazing. Usually you only see the mozzarella shredded like this. Yeah. Oh, that, that's Parmigiano. Next up, the veggies. A blanket of baby spinach and savory sauteed mushrooms. And you get your produce fresh every day. Every day. So it's not just a really kick-ass pizza, it's a real taste of Providence. Yeah. Jose crumbles on tangy feta cheese. Little feta, make it all better. A final dusting of ground Parmesan and the spinach and mushroom pie is perfecto. One of my best friends lived up here for four years, and he never told me about this. And I am now beginning to question our friendship. <laughs> it's the craftsmanship. And with olive oil on a charcoal grill, it's smoky, it's nutty, it's absolutely phenomenal. Wow, those grilled pizzas were a delicious spin on the classic pot.